Hello guys, I'm Baron Galdaros and today I'm gonna show you something really cool. The new expansion is out in Hearthstone, so the Kobolds and Catacombs are actually here and we get a new solo adventure which is Dungeon Run. As you can see, within the twisting tunnels of the Kobold Empire waits treasures beyond imagining. Choose your quest and delve into the ever-shifting dungeon. So the thing is, um, in this uh, Dungeon Run thingy, you can just... Um, Overplay it, so you just play. Uh, you can just play over and over again. So let's see. Adventurers wanted. Let's see. So we we just uh, get um, get a class. Baby Brat deal two damage. This is uh, his hero power for two mana. It's just a baby dragon, but it's still a dragon. So let's see. We can just choose a class right here. We have to defeat eight bosses. So eight. Let's see. I'm gonna just get shaman right here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. So this little whelp has only 10 HP. Um, I just can't kill it. We we started with 15 HP. So let's see. We're just killing it. Yeah, and boom. Around. Um, yeah. We had only four mana, so it was really fast. The first boss is actually fast. We get some extra XP right here, and yeah, and we can just choose between the skills. It's uh, passive, so Justicar's Ring, passive. Your hero power is upgraded and cost one. It's actually really great. Mysterious Tomb, passive. At the start of the game, play three random secrets. It's actually really nice. Robe of the Magi. Passive spell damage plus three. Fuck that shit. We just need these two. I'm not sure about this. Let's see. Let's see this. Upgraded. Yeah, upgraded. It's, it's really good. I guess. Or it's maybe. No, 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 no. Just Mysterious Stone. Fuck that shit. And we can uh, choose between new cards. As you can see Battle Crier, uh, Marlocks, and Mutation. Let's see. Um, I will just get this one right here. United Murlocs, it's actually really great. Um, or maybe this, yeah, Devolve Hex. I'm not sure. Yeah, let, let's just take that prior. And let's see the other boss. The second one, Seriona. A Twilight Dragon bent on draining your minions. Hero power, give a minion minus one attack. Oh, okay, let's just see, let's just see. Let's see. Here we go, here we go. Boom, 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 boom. Sariona defeated. Yeah, here we go, here we go. Okay, we just get mutation. We get two trolls, actually. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, just take this. And the next boss is... Frostfur, hero power, freeze a minion. These full boards, warrants, feel unnaturally cold. Play, 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 play. Yeah, Frostfur is defeated. It was really easy though. So we get another pack here. Yeah, let's see the other bosses. We get. Uh, I'm not sure. Your minions cost zero this turn, boost of haste. Yeah, this one's actually really great. Let's see restoration. We don't need that. Jade Locust or Destruction? Yeah, Jade Locust. Let's see the other boss. Oh, it has 30 HP though. His tunnels are catchy, just ask your minions. Gain control of an enemy minion with two or less tech. Russell the Bird. Let's see. And this one is defeated as well. This is really easy with this um, evolving thingy, it's just really cool. And with this troll. Yeah, let's see. We defeated another one. Okay, totems. I'm not sure. Totems are really great. Elements. We don't need elements. Even though if it's our luck here, we have nice drops right here. Uh, mutation. Yeah, we get... I, I think... Yeah, we get mutations. Let's see the other boss. 40 health. Fungalmancer Flagol. Fungalmancer empowers his friends with fungus. Give your minions plus one one. Hmm. Let's see. It's gonna be interesting. Okay, this one was kinda hard, I guess, but but yeah, we just won. 
Okay, there we go. Well played. It was a headshot, to be honest. We got an extra XP right there. Yeah, and we get uh, another one. Battle cry, yeah. Battle Dolphin, I guess. Mutation, Murloc, Jade. Yeah, let's take Jade. Okay. 50 head, Overseer, Mogark. This draw commander is extra motivational to underlings. Deal one damage to a friendly minion and give it plus five attack. This will be hard, guys. This will be really hard. We just need two more bosses. So let's see. Guys, just go for Jade. As you can see, it's just pretty awesome. Even though um, it's uh, the battle cry activating two times in a row, so it's actually really, really great. This Jade stuff on a rock. Uh, we don't need this. Totems, mechanized. We need battle cries. Inspire is shit for, for us. Yeah, I'm not sure it's. Mm, yeah, just get this one right here and yeah 60 health 60 Vexmancer Starmy this cobalt can candle craft minions at will summon a copy of a minion okay this will be interesting the last one was really hard though but this one doesn't look that hard we'll see this wasn't that hard his hero power costs three, actually, so it's it's just easy, like hell, I guess. Just upgrade this one. Yeah, there we go. These dungeon runs are actually cool, really cool. You get stronger and stronger when you do progress. You get extra XP and some, uh, you know, uh, some cards. It's really good. Greedy pickaxe. After your hero attacks, gain an MP. Mana crystal, it's, it's really nice. Adapt a friendly minion repeats for each boss you have defeated. It. It's nice, but I would uh, use that. We don't need that, we don't need that. Yeah, like this. So, and the last boss is the darkness. The darkness. This is why cobalt's be keeping candles. Oh fuck, for fuck's sake. Hero power cost zero. Summon at 5-5 five, five dark spawn. There is a reason to always keep the lights on down here. Okay, darkness will be really hard. 70 HP. I'm not sure if we can defeat it. We'll see. We just got defeated, guys. This darkness rocks. I wasn't able to defeat it. I'm not sure. Uh, this guy is using some priest cards, so so I am, and always summon these uh, these shits. And when you defeat the mobs uh, or the bosses, as you can see, right here, it's showing. And yeah, we can just go back, I guess. Yeah, we just go back, and we're gonna open the six pack at the end of the video. So let's see. One legendary, please. No legendary. Yeah, the other one. It's just rare. Nothing golden or epic or legendary. Just rare. Again, rare. Yes, legendary dragon color Alanna. Battle guard summon a uh, five-five dragon for each spell you cast this game that costs five or more. Oh, nice. Interesting, though. Here we go. Yeah, it's just a rare. And the last pack. An epic. White Ripper. Nice. Uh, thank you very much, uh, guys, for watching. I was Baron Galdros. I hope you enjoyed this video. I think this uh, Vault Dungeon Run thingy is just awesome. You can just do it again and again and again. And you get quests for it, as you can see, right here. So, it's super playable. You can play for thousands and thousands of time. And it's, it's fun. It's fun and customized. But when you get defeated, it's... Mm, I'm not sure. It's not that great, but... But yeah, at least um, we get a 
really nice playing mode. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, just leave a like and a comment below. And see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Hello, hello, guys. Hello, hello.